Hello, it's Mark. Welcome to another Whiskey Review. Subscribe if you please. Appreciate it. And today we're going to do McAllen. This is the Harmony Collection, Rich Cacao. Now, this is a, I believe this is going to be part of a series, the Harmony Collection. So to me, that is, I'm assuming that means it's going to be a, in a part of the collection. Um, so anyway, this is in collaboration with George, Jordi Rocco pastry chef at El Cedar de Con Roca. Um, so, um, this is 44% ABV and matured in sherry seasoned oak casks. It is natural color, 44% um, probably chill filtered. So we do need to go ahead and open her up with these new McAllen lids. See if I can get this one on right. I haven't done it yet. Nope. Hmm. Okay. So. Okay. So McAllen is a Speyside single malt Scotch. They were founded in 1824. They were the set. They're the second best-selling Scotch in the world, behind Glenfiddich. They're the second most valuable, maybe third, behind also Glenlivet. Um, the translation of McAllen means fertile ground. They're owned by the Edgerton Group since 1999, which they are run by, in turn by the Robertson's Trust, which is a charitable foundation. Um, the um, traditionally they use a lot used to use a lot of Spanish oak, but they expanded their distillery in 2019. They now have like 12 stills, uh, no 36 stills, 12 wash and 24 spirit. Um, so now you're seeing more American oak and such um, come out, starting really with the fine oak line, because they went way over budget on the uh, new distillery expansion and the new visitor center to where you're seeing them crank out a lot of no age statement stuff, because they need some money. Um, but, okay, so let me see what else can I tell you about McAllen. Um, that's really about most of everything. Um, see yeah they did had some exclusivity with the Spanish oak but um, like I said because they're cranking out so much stuff now you see more American oak and European oak which European oak tends to mean French or Bulgarian or Spanish oak is actually from Spain so um, most of their barrels are sherry butts um, but the rest are they do have some that about 20% are American oak and, and such um, okay so, let's give you a look. See here, it did say natural color, right? Natural color. So that's pretty dark for a no age statement. So, okay, I'm gonna go ahead and roll this. And then let's read to you what it says on the bottle. 44% ABV and collaborate. I've already read that. Uh, sherry seasoned oak casks. This expression is inspired by rich cacao as well as exceptional chocolate creations of Jordi Roca, pastry chef of El Cedar de Cana Roca, in his exceptional, ex extraordinary journey to the source of his masterpieces, reinvigorating and giving second life to the discarded husks from cacao pods, has led to this innovative new packaging and becomes the inspiration for. The Whiskey Within. Our whiskey maker, Polly Logan, has created a whiskey using a harmonious combination of exquisite sherry seasoned European and American oak casks, which deliver a unique, rich chocolate, dark chocolate note, along with honey, dates, vanilla, and cinnamon, bottled at 44% ABV to create the perfect pairing with rich, fine chocolate. So apparently, I'm supposed to drink this with chocolate. Uh, this information packaging gives new life. It's got this, uh, I guess, little emblem on there, which you can see. Okay, this doesn't have as much on it, so we'll go ahead and finish it out here. In 1824, we have, since 1824, we've been crafting our single malt scotch whiskey in perfect harmony with the beautiful nature that surrounds the home of the McAllen Estate, Esch Esch Estate in Speyside. Celebrating Our Majesty and 
whiskey making and our collaborative, innovation, innovative and curious mindset, the McAllen Harmony Collection explores and applies the art of using organic byproduct in our packaging, creating a more sustainable alternative for the future. The McGowan Rich Cacao release has been inspired by the exceptional chocolate creations of Jordi Roca, pastry chef of El Cedar de Canroca, and his extraordinary journey to the source of his masterpieces, reinvigorating and giving a second life to the sarded husk of the cacao pods that has led to this innovative new packaging and becomes inspiration for the whiskey within. Joining this voyage, joining the, this voyage of discovery, our whiskey maker Polly Logan has created a whiskey using a harmonious combination of exquisite cherries. It's the same old stuff. Um, okay, so let's go to the nose, roll it again. Okay, got sherry spice in there, got cinnamon. What am I supposed to get? Toasted cacao beans is all it says I'm supposed to have on the nose. I'm not really getting much of that. This is like, they lied. There's chocolate, but it's faint and in the back. It's more orange. There's some butter. Cinnamon. Bitter orange peel. All right, on to the pallet before the train comes. Well, we'll do it when the train comes, that way. Okay. Very buttery. Okay, dark chocolate for sure. dark chocolate like, like that 90% cacao chocolate you know, almost like Baker's chocolate this isn't like sweet chocolate but very buttery there's certainly a cereal note to it so maybe that's the husk from that I don't know definitely got a, a cereal note um, it's good though is it $169 good? Mm, maybe. Really get orange and citrus. I've had other whiskey that tasted more chocolatey than this. Let's see, hold on. I'm getting some of that butter now on the nose. Sorry. It says zesty lime and ginger. Okay, yeah, definitely some ginger. There's definitely a lot of spice in there. Well, that's on the nose. Now, I'm getting that on the palate. Getting citrus, bitter chocolate, some butter, um, cinnamon spice.
down. Bitter orange, bitter chocolate, butter, cinnamon. So it's pretty good. You know, it says what else? It says dark chocolate, honey, dates, vanilla, and cinnamon. There's some van there's some vanilla. So, okay. Eh, I'm not gonna sell my soul. It's a seven. See you next time. Hey.